Well, here we are set up for what's going to be another great fight here. Two big boys here, league. Danny. Yep. Well, cruiserweight coming in at 86 kilo. All set up for a good one. I mean, Kieran Smallcombe over there in the red corner took this fight just a couple of days ago after a pullout. And he's always game this boy to come. And Cole Beck from Team JD walks straight up to him to let him know what he's here to do. Essex Kickboxing Academy and Team JD head to head. Yeah, returning everything tick for tack at the moment. Quite fast for big fellas these two, aren't they, Alex? Yeah, really fast, really good catch and take down there by 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 uh, Carl by Carl Beck. Really yep. good, really good take down. Good start. It's a trait of the big boys, isn't it, when you see the chop and low kicks, it's what they like to do. Yep. Kieran Smallcomb from the Essex Kickboxing Academy leant back onto the ropes there, exchanging two knees with Beck. Good turn as well. And Beck just stalks forward all the time. Smallcomb down to the body. Really good right knee there. I think that hair, Kieran. Looking for the overhaul. Really good trip as he pulls him over the leg. Nice yeah, technique there. Wide punch there, wasn't it, from Beck? And, uh, well, not too much splitting these fighters at this time. It's setting up to be a good fight. Yeah, it's setting up to be a really good fight. There's not, not splitting them in that first round. If anything, coming from... What's known as everything kicks for tack at the moment. Academy. I was surprised to see um, the good tight technique. Quite fast for big fellas, these two, aren't they, Alex? Yeah, really fast, really good catch and take Well, second round here. And Beck taller than Smallcomb here. And I'm sure Kieran Smallcomb can get down to a lighter weight than this, but look, tenacity as he storms forward here. Both these boys are really keen, letting big shots go. I think both these lads will probably make him. Oh, doubled up the leg kick there from Smallcomb. Really Trying to fight for the inside position in the clinch, but his head's low. His head's low, he's going to get an extended eight count if he doesn't pick his head up. See Jesse Saunders having a good look at that. He's got his right leg caught on the rope here. Don't think Jesse can see as, as his leg sli slips through. No, it's good clinch in there, isn't it, from Carl Beck. Didn't know he had that clinch to his game, and he's showing that he's got it here. I think it's starting to show already that he's took this fight on late notice, Kieran. Yeah, it's, I mean, um, all credit to him. He took it late and Beck's laying it down on him. He's, he, he's not going to worry about that, is he? He just yeah. had a mission to come and fight and that's what he's here to do. But Smallcomb needs to really up his product now and he's going to get a standard eight count for that right there. The yep. Fight. Good referee in there by Jesse Saunders. Steps in. Sometimes fighters need to be safe for themselves. He's having a good look. Kieran needs to lay something on him. I think the bell's come at the right time there. Didn't know he had that clinch to his game and he's showing that he's got it here. I think it's starting to show already that he's took this fight on late notice, Kieran. Oh, 
fullback. Didn't know he had that clinch to his game and he's showing that he's got it here. I think it's starting to show already that he's took this fight on late notice, Kieran. Massive, massive round two for Cole Beck, who really came out well there. And, uh, Smallcomb not going to let him just take his foot like that and hold on to his leg. But just getting pressed back on the ropes too much for me at the moment, Smallcomb. And the clinch work is too much at the moment from Beck. Smallcomb needs to get his head up high. He needs to pick his head up and he needs to start coming forward and letting those hands go like he did early on in the first round. Uppercut from Beck. Smallcomb's in trouble here, isn't he, Alex? He is in trouble. That's a second eight count. Near the corner now of Kieran, trying to get him through this fight, trying to push him on. It's a big ask now for Kieran to win this fight. I think he's going to stop the fight. And there it goes. Jesse saved the fighter from himself. Massive credit there to Kieran from Essex Kickboxing Academy. Yeah. He's done himself really yeah, proud. He's done he himself proud. He steps in there last minute. And, and that's a massive he's performance from Beck, who fought really, really well. Really was well, see Beck was just in slightly yeah. better shape. Both them lads are probably make 79 yeah, in definitely. the future. I think so. Late, no, just well, but, do you know what? I'd like to like... see that fight on both lads on a full camp. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. I mean, I'd definitely be keep bringing Kieran for it as well. I, I know he I can know take Kieran this guy spends a lot of fitness, time yep. at your gym, Danny. And, you know, credit to you there, to be honest, Danny, because I know you spend a lot of time training the boys and you've done a really good job, but unfortunately on a day's notice, he was just too fit today. Yeah, I think you're right. And strong in that clinch. And your winner, one minute, ten seconds into round two by TKO, Carl!